In rural Bangladesh, women's involvement in aquaculture is lower than men's. Women, as the primary caregivers, have less time available for fish farming and are often prohibited from entering ponds to harvest fish due to social barriers. Women therefore feed the fish and clean the ponds, while men mostly do the harvesting and marketing. <laughs> To increase involvement by women, the USAID-funded project Aquaculture for Income and Nutrition, AIN, led by World Fish, teaches women how to grow nutrient-rich small fish called mola in their household ponds. As part of the eight-day training, women learn how they can harvest these fish themselves using gill nets. Um, gill net is a net that is not a net. gill net is a net that is a net that is a net that is a net that is a key advantage of gill nets is that women don't have to enter the ponds to harvest fish. This encourages women to harvest fish regularly, which is helping households increase their access and consumption of fish. <laughs> The nets measure 7.6 meters wide by 1.8 meters high and are made from mesh rope, empty bottles, and rocks or broken bricks. As part of the training, women learn how to construct and use the low-cost nets to catch mola and nutritious ways to cook the fish. <laughs> Since 2015, the project has provided training on gill nets to 155 women from 18 nutrition groups in Barisal district. As more women hear about the gill nets from their neighbors and friends, they too want to make one for themselves. Gill nets are proving to be successful because they meet the needs and preferences of women, enabling them to get more involved in aquaculture. These nets are providing a brighter future for women and their families by increasing access to nutritious fish and boosting consumption of fish. <laughs>